Halloween warning that you may not have ever thought about. Well, your child's bulky or puffy costume could be a safety hazard if they're riding in a car seat. Better Call Harry has today's Consumer Reports. Candy, haunted houses, ghoulish costumes. It's Halloween and kids just want to have fun. But Consumer Reports warns there might be a real life scare inside of your car. Bulk or puffy costumes might cause your child's car seat harness to not fit correctly, which means it might not offer optimal protection in a crash. Philip has this nice puffy costume with fake muscles. We don't want to wear puffy costumes underneath our car seat harness because doing that can add additional room to the harness in the event of a crash. And that additional room in the harness will now make it so that there's more room for the child to move during the crash and potentially move outside the protection of their car seat. Consumer Reports advice. Have your little ghoul or goblin change into their costumes after they get to the party. If your child is a little older and plans on trick-or-treating, make sure he or she can see and be seen. Children are more than twice as likely to be hit and killed by a car on Halloween than any other day of the year. To be safer, avoid masks that block vision and consider face painting instead. And if you are driving on Halloween, always watch for children as you enter and exit driveways and alleys. A hand-me-down costume is a great money saver, but if it's too big, your child could trip, so adjust it for a proper fit. And don't forget about reflective tape. Add it to costumes in bags and give them glow sticks so they can more easily be seen on the darkest and spookiest of Halloween nights. And if your kid has a mask or a long dress or a cape, Consumer Reports says try and keep them on the sidewalk if you can to keep them from tripping. I'm Better Call Harry with a spooky Consumer Reports.